Hey darling, well, come on in to our living room, sit on the couch with us. Today we are doing a couple's Q&A. Interesting. <laughs> I'm Bianca, this is Christian, and together we're going to answer some questions. So I asked you guys on my Instagram um, to send us in some questions that we could maybe answer and just, um, yeah, we have 10 questions is today. It, is it going to be difficult? I don't know. Do I need a clip note? I hope not. <laughs> Okay. okay, so first one. Do you guys like it when girls don't wear makeup? Am I speaking now for all the guys or just yeah. for me? Yeah, I you. don't know. <laughs> Both. <Yo. laughs> uh, I, I feel that you, they, <laughs> don't have to wear makeup all the time. But when it's a fancy dress and you're going out, and I think then you have to. Mm, but yeah, it's it's different. But do you think girls are pretty without makeup? They are pretty girls. <laughs> pretty girls are pretty. <laughs> okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. How do you deal with morning breath? I don't think it matters. No. We don't really. It doesn't bother us at all. Mm -mm, nothing. Like, there's nothing to deal with. No. Next question. How do you feel about periods? Me? Yes. Um, I obviously hate them. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> They're a pain in the pain <laughs> everywhere. So. Um, but, oh, wow. Well. It's, it's difficult when you are on your period for me. But uh, I try to consider you and what you're going through and um, just take it as it is. And I know it will pass again. <laughs> and come again. Yeah, well, that's life. <laughs> <laughs> Not awkward or uncomfortable or anything like that. And I don't try to hide it. No. So just communication. If there's a problem, just talk to each other. Um, discuss what the issue is but really it's fine mm. I get moody so on day three <laughs> or the day before you just take notes yeah <laughs> I want chocolates <laughs> yeah, well you want chocolates all of the time so every uh, day I don't think that three is. times a day <laughs> it's going with the period <laughs> Okay, what's something specific that a husband wants his wife to pray for? I don't know. It's a difficult question. I think uh, just to be safe throughout the day is the, is the most important, maybe. Mm. And also, if, if I come home, that I'm um, not irritated or blaming you for stuff you did not do because I'm irritated because of work stuff. That's difficult. Yeah. Someone said, I don't know if you know, like someone once said, like, they leave it somewhere, they have a tree at their home. Mm -hmm. Who was that? I can't remember. And then you just like pick up the work things when you pass the tree and when you come home you pray and you leave it there again. Mm. Um, but it is difficult because you also want to talk about your day and get some support. Um, but I think normally I pray for you for clarity, guidance, obedience, safety. Because you yeah. work in some dangerous places. Like I said, safety, I think, is one of the most important things. And math skills every day. <laughs> math skills. I think my math is quite fine, thank you. <laughs> make sure you don't make any errors along the way. That's why I use a calculator to double check <laughs> what is 3 plus 3. 
Okay, calculate this kid. <laughs> yeah. But I also think it's important to pray for like your relationship and you as a person and things like that as well. Um, because we need to protect each other from any spiritual attacks as well. Nice. Okay, next question before we go in too deep. Okay. <laughs> Number six, how to check in with your spouse? Yeah, I... I... Presume you asked this question. <laughs> no. Oh no. Okay. <laughs> because, uh, well, well, like I've told you, when I get a phone call from you, I always worry. Yeah. Like is something wrong. What's going on? So did I should get WhatsApp that? you did, first, did, did, did and like, I'm going that? to call you now. <laughs> no. <laughs> but if you WhatsApp me, it's fine. Then I'm, no, not important. Yes, you don't respond. <laughs> Yeah, because I'm busy working. What? So, but when you phone me, it's, it's uh, I always get a fright a bit and then I just call myself down and then I answer and then I... Ask but it's like when... Well, uh, normally when you invite people over, you would call me and, you know, that typical breakup quote everybody uses, like, we need to talk about something. <laughs> and then I'm like, what? <laughs> about what? <laughs> yeah. And you like being mysterious. <laughs> yes, I do. <laughs> it makes me nervous. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah. Yeah, but um, we also do family meetings when we feel like it. When we, when we, we try to do family meetings on Sundays. Mm. And that helps. And again, communication. Just, just ask. Just talk about it. Just... Don't ask, like, how are you? Ask more specific questions. Like, how are you feeling about this? How did you experience that? How are you handling this? Um, what would your reaction be about whatever hypoth hypothetical thing? Um, just to check in where the person's at mentally, emotionally, all of those things. Yeah. Okay. How do you make time for God? Well, like we are trying or, or busy doing from the start of this year is we wake up each morning at 5.30 uh, I go and make us some coffee and then you can sit here in the living room and we read out of the Bible and then I pray for us. That's how we do our... That's how we are doing it now. And... Um, yeah, normally we would read at night um, in bed, but he would fall asleep or I would fall asleep beforehand or we'd be too tired to read, you know, there's always some excuse. And uh, making time is important, so mm, we're yeah. really trying. Yeah, we are trying. So we haven't missed, basically, we haven't skipped one um, so far, so that's good. It's going good. Yes. Even though I fall asleep while reading, but it's okay. I'll wake you up now again. So. <laughs> but it's going. Um, alone time, I'd say I would. Um, I'm a very conversational type of prayer relationship, a uh, relationship type of person. So I would just go through the day and just chat, um, chat with the Holy Spirit and just talk about anything and everything really. Um, and so that's what I do personally, and I always have a reading plan for. Um, if I go to bed at early or when you're on the toilet or something like that. I also like to um, read um, Christian-based books. At the moment, we are reading Captivating and... Exhilarating. <laughs> I don't know. Okay. Um, what's your biggest turn off? Of what? Turn off of a woman. Well, if they smoke. Yep. <laughs> Anything else? Oh, that's maybe the only biggest thing. 
I don't like guys this way. No, that's all they are. Especially if it's like very provocative type of swearing. Mm. That's just a no-no. Okay. I think that's the biggest one. Go away. Uh-uh. Alone time. Talk about alone time. What about that? I don't know. Um, basically, he gets alone time or we get alone time um, at night. So we have certain days of the week that we split up and um, get some alone time in. And it was difficult at first because I'm clingy. But it's been going good. It's been working. So it's basically what? Mondays? Thursdays? That's all they are. Uh-uh. I only get Mondays and Thursdays. <laughs> and you take a Tuesday or a Wednesday. You get every second Wednesday. Mm, not this year. Why not? The routine hasn't started this year. It's starting tomorrow. Yeah, starting tomorrow, yeah. <laughs> So, and you take Sundays sometimes? Sometimes. But not all of the time. We get enough alone time. Mm. So, um, I would basically just work on art things or um, read or watch TV. And he likes to either work on projects or play games. Yes. Any other commentary on alone time? I would uh, like to take my alone time and maybe nap. You can do whatever you want in your yeah, alone time. No, but then I can't do anything else. <laughs> it's like you want to do this, but mm. then what about that? You're not going to get another chance to do that. Yes. <laughs> Any advice on giving each other alone time? Don't try to do too much stuff. I also think like... Don't think about it, because that was my problem. Don't think about it as you don't want to spend time together or somebody wants to separate from you. Think about it as you need to recuperate and you need to spend time with friends or you need to do some self-care. And um, you need to do self-care in uh, in order for you to actually work together as a team. Um, Yeah, you need to rejuvenate. Also, alone time is not... um I lock myself in my room and nobody's coming in or nothing. I mean, you want to talk to me, I'm just next door or in the other room Mm -hmm. or outside or it's not like we are separated. And sometimes I sit there with you. Yes. So it's about doing an activity that's serving you. Yes. Basically. Or looking after you. Okay, last question. How many times to have sex a week? It depends. <laughs> on? on your menstruation. <laughs> I don't know. Um, well, it, it differs a lot from couple to couple, month to month as well, <laughs> week to week. Yes, sometimes it's. Every night or every second night or other times it's once a week. It depends on on your emotional state as well and your physical state and Mm. your energy throughout the day. Um, But it also definitely depends on where you as a couple are. And how do you feel? Maybe you go home and you don't feel great at all. Sometimes it helps. Sometimes you just don't want to. Yeah, it makes it so worse. It's, yeah, it's difficult to say. There's no number. No. Just go with it, though. Just go with it. But don't... Not once a month. I think that's a bad number. Yo, that's a little not... I think, like, once a week is a, maybe a healthy number. Or at least once bi-weekly. Because you need to work... It's Sex is important for a marriage couple. Yes. Like... It's very important. It, there's a reason it exists. It makes it's like when that you get married, you, you are one, yeah, and that bonds you again. Yes. 
Um, so, and also sex is a way of serving one another and, um, yeah, it's, imp- it's important. Don't, don't not do it. No, don't not. <laughs> do it. <laughs> Now. <laughs> Later. No, <laughs> do it. Yeah. Okay. That's all of the questions. Okay. That, wasn't, that wasn't too bad. You did your first video with me. Are you glad? Yeah. Did okay. you like it? It's fine. It's a bit odd. It is. We need an echo. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm the really window. sure we are sweaty. <laughs> I'm sure we are. Yeah. Uh, but thanks for coming. Remember to subscribe, like if you would like to see more of these. Please comment down below. And thanks for popping by on our couch. Thank you. See you guys next time. Bye.